What's up everybody, this is Sean with Swank's Chrome and Diesel Shop. I'm gonna tell y'all what, I'm excited today because today I got all my material and everything I'm gonna do for this, for this trailer that I've been mocking all these boxes up on. Y'all been seeing them a couple times on my videos and hopefully, hopefully, probably won't happen because I'm saying it too loud, I can get this guy done out of my way, off my plate because you know what? These long ass tedious jobs, man, with a whole lot of shit, it really ties me up. And especially when I got customers coming in like all throughout the day wanting those small things done and I gotta turn them down. But today, today's good. It's a good day right here. I'm excited. You know what? I'm gonna show y'all exactly what I'm talking about here. Y'all remember my trailer? Let me step back here. Y'all got this. It's my trailer that I've been adding like 300 lights on. Let me slow down so y'all catch up. Yeah, boom. All the lights are in there. But you know what? He come by and said, hey, Sean, I want some more lights. So I'm like, ah, you know what? All right, let's do it. Let's just make it a Christmas tree. It's going to be like the Griswolds. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The Griswold, uh, what is, nope, that's not the National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation there. That movie. It's going to be like when he lights his house up. Except when I turn my lights on, everything works. I don't have a little switch doing it for somebody that I just get mad at the family and kick over my Santa Claus and my reindeer. But here we go. Y'all, I showed y'all last time how much wobble that this box had because this guy here was 79 inches, whereas my other four boxes are 36. You see on that other side? Three, boom, three 36s. To eliminate that, and I've already got some mocked up in there right now. Got my everything right here is quarter inch, so all I did was just brace out right there. I'm making a basket, pretty much. Y'all can see that shit. Making a basket, a basket, a brisket. It ain't barbecue. I'm making a basket there. Got everything mocked up in there. All my plates, everything tacked in. Got my beans to support. That big long basket right there. Doing all of this with, yes, yeah, right, you guys see it, my Lincoln 180 Pro Mig. You know, this guy does a pretty good job right here. Um, I'll show y'all some of my welds. Let me get up in here. Look, Oop, back up a little bit. That's just one of my little welds right there on that guy. And I got some vertical, but these are just tack welded up in there. I'm gonna end up hitting probably the bottom side too because I'm gonna grind all these down so the box can sit as flush as it can. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and support these guys. Beat all the way across, beat all the way across. I'm gonna do it on the back side also. And then what I got, Get down here. Y'all see my boxes on this side. I got me some squared tubing that I'm gonna brace from this box to that box. That way, it keeps the bottom steady. You say you probably, that's not my phone, that is this thing rocking right here. I got some two by twos put across to eliminate some of that. Then, also, coming up right here, step back. I got me some six inch aluminum beam. Look at that guy. That's what I figured. That's probably, that's like the best looking thing I could think of for this timetable situation where this guy wanted to pick his trailer up in like a week and a half. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna fill this gap right here between the box and the trailer, right there, bam. I'm gonna line that joker up right there. And then that way, I'm gonna bolt that from the box to the trailer and it's gonna secure everything. Now, I'm gonna sit the phone down. I'm gonna see if I can't get some welding in here today. See how much y'all got me there? Now I know all y'all gonna see is just my ass right now, but I want you to just listen to the weld right now. Then I'll show you a little bit. I'll show you how I got it in there. Oop, phone, get, just sit back. Hopefully nobody calls my phone right now. All right, there we go, I'm up in there. This out the way. Get my hat out the way. I'm gonna do, I like that as much light as possible because you see I got the door open and it's throwing off a sunlight in that's making it darker in here than it needs to be. So I'm gonna hang up a little drop light in there to help me out a little bit. Get it right. There we go. This guy over. Get my 
we go. I want y'all to pay attention. If it sounds like bacon fried, that's awesome. If it sounds like popcorn, that means I'm fucked up somewhere, but get off my ass. Get it out of my damn way. 